Yeah, my name is Imanine Mpinga. Uh, today, I'll be with you in a very, very interesting session. We are going to, we are, we are going to do an experiment, a very remarkable experiment, which is going to be in your memory, <laughs> inshallah, almost in, in your life. This experiment has been proved uh, with one um, American-based uh, organization known as SEGA. Uh, they have gone through deep research and they found that this experience is almost everlasting. So, inshallah, um, um, I'm sure also this, I mean the same experiment We'll have some two experiments. Um, I'm sure also it's going to make a, a very remarkable and a memorable experience ever, shall we? To start, we have some cups here. We have this uh, very, very good, uh, fancy, fancy, extraordinary cups. You see? Yeah. So you'll choose yourself. I'll pass through to distribute these cups. You choose by yourself, okay? Whether you choose this or you choose this, uh, according to how you will decide on yourself, okay? All right. So choose this. He 
saw me with this fantastic bottle. This manager loved my bottle. And he gave me an assignment. When I finish this assignment, he's going to pay me. So the assignment he gave me is to finish up this <coughs> bottle, is to finish up the water inside the classroom. When I finish this bottle, at the end of the day, I'm going to be paid. Is it clear to everybody? Yeah. So this is the manager who have given me this assignment. Okay? So this big assignment, I'm supposed to finish it into the classroom. Let me find this manager outside. So I am in. I'm given this responsibility to finish this water in the classroom. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. I finished the bottle. Should I be happy? Should I be happy? Yes, of course. I must be happy. Yes, I'm going to be paid. All of the water. This time, um, the manager had a different opinion. The manager says to me that I have to put um, the water at least to a certain minimum amount to every student. No matter whether I finish or I don't finish, there's no necessity of finishing this water. Okay? So you give me the, this assignment. Okay, no problem. We'll pay you. But your responsibility will be to make sure that at least every student gets the, the minimum amount of water. Okay? So this is the assignment I'm given. And um, I'm given the responsibility of making, uh, giving you at least the minimum amount. So every one of you have to mark at least at this level, okay? So I'll give you a pen. Make sure you mark the minimum uh, amount of uh, uh, water which you want. So I have this piece of uh, bottle. It's 
so I'm in the classroom. I am in for this round two. The minute I get to the assignment. My criteria, which is different from the previous one, you remember the, the previous assignment that I was given? What was the criteria? To finish what? To finish the water. I mean to finish all the water. And now, the criteria today is not to finish, but at least everyone should have the minimum amount of water. Okay? Remember now, you have some water, okay?
Okay. Um, Brothers and sister, um, I would like to have this session to discuss what happened. And to be precise, let us start with round one. What happened in round one of our experiment? So kindly discuss in your group what happened, okay? You can discuss as to what happened from all the uh, what happened in all the steps. Uh, what did you see? What did you hear? Everything. Discuss. Everything that is 
and sister, uh, <coughs> where the men in your, seated in your groups, um, can we share, okay, can we share loudly, uh, I want to learn from you, um, we saw from round one, okay, so what does water represent? Just consider, consider that this is a teaching learning process okay so what does water represent in our teaching yes brother knowledge okay okay knowledge okay um oh can say what Water, what is water? Knowledge. This is knowledge, it's quite all right. Content. Content. Very good. So, water represents content. Very good. And what does the cups represent? If water is knowledge, then what does water represent? Students. Students. Excellent. That's why I like the student masters. Yeah. Students. It comes to present students. And maybe in round one, what was my main focus? Uh -huh. Brother? In round one, it seemed that it is unsatisfactory way because. Teacher what was there, what was yes 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 in there just to give the benefit of the money for many <coughs> so he just go randomly to give the knowledge to students without considering their level of understanding so it seems some of the students were not satisfied with the method <coughs> given by teacher how did I distribute the water randomly randomly uh -huh. Just to cover the syllabus. Ah, wow. Ah, okay. Um, so that means uh, what I was only looking was to cover the, the syllabus. Wonderful. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm so much uh, interested to I mean to hear that it is something related to. Uh, the syllabus, that is the content, only to finish the content, okay? And um, what did you feel really? I want to learn from you. What did you feel from round one? I want to learn your feelings. Confused? Yes. <coughs> yes, brother? Yes, yes, yes. From round one, 
Most the students were confused. The people were not happy. Yes. Some missed the. Yeah. They didn't get to them. Some were not satisfied. Why this you are given and others are not given? Yes. My intention is uh, something I, I, I had my own intention. Yes, I was promised something. Yes. More confusion was happening as I was doing the wrong one. Yes, brother. Yeah. <coughs> Ah, you were not happy because you saw me uh, from the point one that what I was considering was my salary. Yeah. I didn't mind whether a student did something or not. Uh, it was uh, at least uh, just to just to finish up. Yes. Also, <coughs> what I found on the first round, I thought that some 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 students get the concept, but in wrong way. For example, <coughs> other water were poured outside. Maybe they miss up some content on mm. that. Exactly. Thank you so much. Wonderful. Wonderful. Extraordinary. Yes. Uh -huh. Anyone else? Yes, brother. Unsatisfactory. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, brothers and, uh, and sister. Now, now, how can we relate the round one experiment with the uh, uh, negative behaviors that we have been um, uh, you have been doing it in class that is happening in class? How do you relate this experiment with the very, very negative behaviors that is happening today, that is happening now actually in class? Yes, I would like to learn from you. How do you relate this? To be honest, yes, brother. What they care is the syllabus in a specific period of time. In La Gambia, you have to cover certain syllabus only for three months. It's up to you to cover them. So, when you have to cover them, 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 you have to cover them. So, you mean, um, um, with some, other, some schools, uh, they just con they give you the assignment and they give you the, the framework of time. That I give you three months, to make sure you finish this one. So now it becomes the responsibility of the respective teacher. Whatever how, how means he or she is going to use, he or she is supposed to finish it in a specified period of time. Oh. Yes. Brother. <laughs> Yani kwa nakuza mbao kwa vizuri zaidi tuwa 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 represente vikumbele kama hivi Na kwa nakuza mbao Yani kuna tofauti ya wanakuza Ila mwalimu jowa nifane katika laundu wani Yani hakuyali zile tofauti za wanakuza Wonderful, wonderful So In fact As to the differences of these cups The students are unique They are different But the teacher didn't consider The uniqueness of students uh, what he considered was to finish and put all, all, all the things he has or she has on the students. The reflection into the classroom. Yes. Here, you know, you know, by the only man in general, I sign Hungary, and then you know, I found them both, and you always watch me, and you always watch you, and I treat them the same way. You know, Hungary, you know, 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 you know. So, students, I mean, teachers, when they get to class, they uh, never consider the situations of different stu students. Uh, what they uh, do is to make sure they what? 
complete. They complete. They complete the content. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Yes. Any comment from round one? I think we're done. Okay. Yes, brother. Ah, pia ukija kwenye round one, how about round two? The one we did. Ukitizama, ukitizama hivi is glassy. Kuna moja ni transparent, na nyingine sio transparent. Kwamba reflection ya hapa pia ni kwamba kuna wanafunzi ambao wanaonekana kabisa kama nikimfundisha kwa kiasi hiki atakuwa katika level hii. Lakini kuna wanafunzi wengine ambao hafahamiki. Yaani uko katika stage hii kwamba haelewi, anaelewa kiasi au all yeah. these easy glass pieces in a reflection in your Ah, so the reflection from the glass that students are different. Yes. Students are <coughs> unique. They have their own different characteristics. Yes. But now the teacher didn't consider the differences between the uh, students. His matter was to finish the content. His matter was to finish the content all over. <laughs> yes. Whether... <coughs> yes, um, we have done with uh, round one. Now, um, round two again. What happened with round two? I am so much interested to learn. What happened? <coughs> and what did you see? What does all the behaviors that happened in round two represent it? So kindly discuss again, discuss again in, in, in your respective groups <coughs> and then we'll share.
sharing and I think there might be some elements of uh, thinking all of what that have been happening in round one as compared to round two you see and just to uh, make it um, uh, as, as, as a minute review um, with the round one the concentration or the focus was in what in it was in context. <coughs> it was content. It was content centric, okay? And it was the interest of a student, isn't it? It was for interest of a student. It was for interest of what? Teacher. A teacher. It was for the interest of the teacher himself. So this was teacher. Teacher centric. It was only for content. Yeah? The learner was not uh, the focus of that, uh, uh, that part of uh, teaching, okay? It was no, no longer um, focused to learn and um, to learn. But with the second second round, this was the, for the first round, okay? First round, second round. <coughs> How was this? What did what happened <coughs> with round two? Yes, brother. The uh, cooperation between teachers and student and the student. Ah, cooperation between the teacher and cooperation between students themselves. Oh wow! What a wonderful answer. A wonderful comment. So this was. Yeah, we call it a cooperative learning. Cooperative learning. <coughs> cooperative learning. Uh -huh. What happened? What other things that you saw in round two? What did you see? Other behaviors that you, you see that it, it happened in round two. What did you see me doing? How did I distribute the water? Yes, yes, brothers wants to contribute here and there, here and there. Mm, yes, brother. There was consideration of individual differences and individual requirements. Wonderful. Yes. Brother, you wanted to speak. Too much concentration. Too much concentration. There was concentration, uh, which means that I was like. What was this? 
what was I doing when I was trying to see the amount of water? Huh? What was this? What did this behavior uh, represent? Yes. It implies that uh, you need to give someone the required, the required uh, mm -hmm. amount of water. So okay. it was to see if this is the ready. Um, meet the so what do, what do we call this one in teaching? Yes. Evaluation. Very good. Evaluation. Or we can call it assessment. Assessment. And actually, this is the, how many times did I do this ass uh, assessment? Many times. Many times. So this is what we call it. Continuous assessment. Okay? We had the continuous assessment. And actually, if you consider the term assessment, we have two kinds of assessment. We have the assessment for learning, and we have the assessment of learning. <coughs> what is the difference? Yes. Of learning? Yes. It just uh, come after? After. Yes. At the end? Yes. Eh? In terms of exams, yes. in terms of quizzes, yes. in terms of tests, that is assessment of, of learning. learning. But what was happening in round two was assessment for Very good, brother. Thank you. This is assessment for. This is assessment for learning. Wow. What a good composition of you teachers here. Eh? Okay. So we had this, and uh, um, we had the, the cooperative learning, we have the assessment for learning. And we considered what? When we were uh, looking the minimum amount of water, what is that? What is that? Wow! Yes! Yes, brother? Yeah, it actually applies as the half load that the learner is supposed to get. That thing that the learners are supposed to get. Wonderful, you guys. I need to work with you, man, yeah? Brothers and sisters. Yes. This implied the things that students were supposed to get. What do we call it? What do we call them? Yeah? Something outcomes. What are they? The students are supposed to get at the end of Learning, learning outcomes. So we consider the as differed from round one, which didn't consider about the learning outcomes. Round one considered about what? Yes, the content. And so to see, this was which kind of being centric? Centric to what? This, yes? This is to the, to the learner. And I think we should uh, make it more, more comprehensive. This is learner. Because I'm, 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 I'm afraid if I say Lena, maybe someone will put S, Lena's. Yeah. This is to consider a single Lena in a class. Brothers and sisters, this is, the round two was Lena centric.
trick. You just learn on central. And um <coughs> Yes. Okay. Can I go back? So in this case, you see, the teacher is changing his role from just becoming a mere teacher to becoming who? A facilitator. So a teacher becomes a facilitator and no longer just a mere teacher to facilitate learning. And now a facilitator is not the custodian of knowledge. As you saw, students were moving from one point to another. To do what? Share. To share. Okay? As it differed from the first round where the knowledge came from, only the teacher had the knowledge. Only the teacher had the skills. Only the teacher had the attitudes. So, um, <coughs> so to say, um, <coughs> Some they 
they just uh, don't come to school because they don't like a teacher, because they use a teacher centered every time, like lecture method, they don't like. But this is active. It will make them to be cooperative with the teacher and other outcomes will come. Bigger, bigger brother. Keep it up. Yeah. Thank you. Anyone who wants to speak? Yes. Uh, because the the second round was uh, a spot for me, so this it promotes much dependence to, to students. I want students to be dependent rather than being independent to, uh, to, to the provider. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. that is uh, the outcome which can be built by the <coughs> Wow. The interdependence between students and dependence, I mean to, um, to make students to be confident by themselves and not depending only from the teacher, depending from uh, different sources of uh, knowledge, see? Very, very good. Very, very good. Brothers and sisters, um, so much looking to hear, to see, to learn. Are you going to be teacher-centric? Well, in a century, I don't know what are you going to do. I want, I want you guys uh, to write for yourself. And I want to see what you are writing. To see the actions you are taking as from today onwards. I want to see the actions that you will be taking as uh, by virtue of your responsibilities, by virtue of you being a classroom teacher. You see? I want to see uh, your action plans. Yeah? At least some few items to use. I mean, I, I just take your pieces of uh, sheets, of paper, and pens. You can drink this water. It is very safe water. Okay? <laughs> now, by now you can drink. Yes. Uh -huh. So, uh, please write down the action items that you declare yourself that as from now I am going to do one, two, three, four. And now, in order to do this, I, I'm, I, I will start with something. Someone will help me. Um, I will do this somewhere else. A certain organization will help me. Anything you want to, to plan is your actions taken after this session. So much important. Yes. <laughs> and I'm going. I'm, I, I think I'm, I'm, I'm much interested to see the the steps. I will start with this one. I will do this one. I will start with this one, then this one, then this one, this, then this one. The steps that you want to do. Not just the statements, but the actions which you will start. Even if we'll uh, make end of this session, and we are going at the end of this session now, um, also, uh, I would like to learn uh, what is your feelings. Uh -huh. How was uh, your situation before coming to this class? Uh, you can just write um, a small, a small article. You see, you can just uh, write a small article too um, by yourself now. Uh, what was your situation before coming to this session and how was uh, how do you see in the meantime uh, the situation is as um, as we did the two experiments what did you see what did you learn 
and then you plan for the future. Okay? Uh, what will you do in the in the future? So this article may be also um, a good point of your action um, uh, to see that you will do something in trained way. That this was your situation before coming to this session, and you got something from this session. What are they one, two, three, four? And then, just from today onwards, in your teaching, in your supervision to the teachers, what will you do? Kindly write that one. And you can keep this one as a memory by yourself. When it happens that I come next, when it happened that we meet with you in different avenues, I would have loved to see that very sheet, a very small sheet of paper, maybe one, just one page, okay? Uh, lamented to keep it a memory of, of yourself. You will see it in some years to come, something that is going to be very, very impactful for yourself and to the, and to the Ummah. So kindly, um, uh, write this small article by yourself to explain uh, what were your feelings what, um, uh, when, when you got the information that you're supposed to come to this session how did you feel how did you perceive and then what did you find it here what are your feelings from being into this session how if you would have missed this session um, is there anything that gained um, um, in, in your career? Is there th something that you get it afresh? So, what is your action items then next? So please, um, we would, uh, I would like to end here. Otherwise, otherwise, if there is any, any remark, question, or whatever, you're most welcome. I thank you so so much, and um, uh, I would like to end here.